Welcome back to Product Critique. Today, we're diving into the Honor Pad 9, a tablet that's been turning heads with its promise of an iPad-like experience on Android. Let's see if it lives up to the hype. First up, let's talk display. The Honor Pad 9 sports a stunning 12.1-inch IPS LCD screen with a 2560 by 1600 resolution and a buttery smooth 120Hz refresh rate. Whether you're binge-watching your favorite shows or browsing the web, this display is a visual treat. Unlike many Android tablets, the Pad 9 runs on Magic OS based on Android 13, offering a user interface that's remarkably similar to iOS. It's intuitive, responsive, and integrates seamlessly with Google services. Multitasking is a breeze thanks to smart gestures and Honor Connect for device synchronization. Now, let's get into performance. Powered by the Snapdragon 6 Gen 1 chipset and 8GB of RAM, the Pad 9 handles casual gaming and productivity tasks well. However, it does show some limitations under heavier loads like intensive multitasking or editing large files. If longevity matters to you, the Pad 9 won't disappoint. It packs an 8300mAh battery that easily lasts through a day of heavy use supporting fast charging up to 35W for quick top-ups. On the downside, the audio quality leaves a bit to be desired despite having multiple speakers. They sound a bit tinny and lack bass punch. As for the cameras, well, they're there for basic use but don't expect stellar performance for anything beyond video calls. So, let's sum it up. The Honor Pad 9 excels with its iPad-esque design, vibrant display, and a software experience that's smooth and familiar. It's great for media consumption and everyday tasks, but falls short in raw processing power and audio quality. Overall, if you're looking for an Android tablet that leans towards an iPad experience without breaking the bank, the Honor Pad 9 could be a solid choice. Just keep in mind its limitations compared to its pricier competitors in the market. That wraps up our review of the Honor Pad 9. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that bell icon for more in-depth product critiques. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Until next time, stay tuned and stay curious. This is signing off from Product Critique.